What's up guys, it's your boy, the man, the myth, the legend, back at it again with the Mutt Drafts gameplay video. Now in this video, you guys see the team, and we are definitely looking very good. Uh, we are playing against an opponent who also has a very good team. You guys see, that's our top three. We have Zeke on our team, and DRC, and then of course our legend. I'm pretty sure that was Willie McGinnis, if I'm not mistaken. But you guys see, my opponent ends up starting out with the ball. He's with the Redskins jerseys. We have the other jerseys. I don't know what exact team that is. I think it's like an other team. Uh, but you guys see, we are trying to stop him. Mutt drafts. Hopefully, if we win all four games, we get like 20k and an elite card you guys end up seeing right here he ends up dumping off the ball but look at that hit needs to go into replay boom oh my god that was beautiful we end up recovering the fumble and we end up getting the ball back and then first play Ezekiel Elliott off to the races going down the sidelines keeping his feet in bounds ends up scoring a touchdown what a beautiful run by Ezekiel Elliott. And you guys know, if I show the kickoff, that always means something is important or something that is important is going to happen. You guys see my stupid opponent ends up taking the ball out. He did not need to do that. He ends up getting stopped at the one. What a bad read right there. We almost got the interception right here. He ends up running the ball. I did not think he was going to pass then run. I thought he was going to run first. And so it kind of surprised me. And right here, he gets the first down with Aaron Rodgers all the way down to the 12. Definitely sucks. Would have liked to try and have gotten a safety or maybe a turnover. And we end up not getting any of those. Uh, but you guys see right here, my opponent has nobody open. He ends up throwing a check down to the running back. We have that manned up. He is not going anywhere. Then we end up sending the blitz on second and seven. We end up getting him into a third and 12. He ends up throwing the screen pass. That is not going to work for us. Fourth and five. We end up sending minimal hate, and he tries to run for the first down. Nobody open. He was about to throw it up, even though nobody was open. And we end up sacking him and getting the ball back. Right now, I'm trying to stay a little bit conservative. You guys see, I'm running the ball on first down. Second down, I ran the ball. And third down, I ran the ball. I really thought we were going to be able to get uh, some open holes we weren't able to. And I'm not too worried about his offense. Right here, I had RB wide open. And what a horrible throw by my quarterback. And we end up not getting the first down, even though our tight end was wide open. And right here, my opponent throws an absolute blind read. And for some reason, EA just bails him out. What a horrible read. Should have been a sack, really. And right there, uh, he almost gets the first down. Luckily, our D-line was pretty fast. But, yeah, he should not be this far down the field. Right there, I was right there, and they just gave me no animation. This was definitely a very frustrating game because he ends up scoring a touchdown that he did not deserve at all. He was just throwing blind reads the whole drive. And it was just a very frustrating drive for me. But I am not fearing anything right now because my opponent cannot guard the flats. And he ran a lot of cover one hole. So I was not worried too much about my opponent. I was really trying to establish the run. Uh, but you guys see right here, still not guarding the flats. I try to do a spin move with Zeke. But Zeke just wasn't doing too good besides that first run of the game. So that was definitely frustrating. Right there, I try to get... Uh, the catch where I go down to the ground, the possession catch, but I was not able to. And I had X wide open on that play, but I decided not to throw him. And then on fourth down, we end up getting the first down. Definitely a very good throw. And then we tr almost get the touchdown right there, but my big feet end up stepping out of bounds. That definitely sucked. And we're really trying to get into the end zone right before half. And you guys see beautiful run defense by my opponent. Definitely sucked that we weren't able to get in the first two tries. And then on the third try, Zeke just gets no push. And we end up settling for a field goal on fourth down. Definitely was pretty mad because I expected more from Zeke. We spent, um, or I thought he was going to do much better than he did. And he's supposed to be an 89 overall. He did not play like that, in my opinion. And I just felt disappointed in how he played. But you guys see third and seven. We end up throwing an absolute dot down the middle, and we end up getting it all the way inside the 35-yard line of my opponent, and we're definitely feeling very good with how our offense has looked because he keeps running cover two, so I know the middle is going to be wide open, and sometimes he ran man coverage, so he only ran like two plays on defense, so I felt very comfortable because they weren't very good plays. You guys see I'm trying to waste out the clock. We're already in the fourth quarter. Touchdown pretty much 
ends the game. You guys see, I keep on running it. I put Zeke at my fullback, and I kept running it with Zeke down the middle. We end up getting a flag there, but on third and goal, we end up throwing it into the end zone, and we end up scoring on the slant. Like I said, he kept running, man. And right here, I decided to go for two because I did not want to get my kick blocked in return because that's how EA works this year. It's so bad on blocked extra points because it happens so much, and this game just bails out bum bums over and over again. So I was not going to go for two. And you guys see right here, he ends up juking me out of my feet. Great play by my opponent. He gets us him. He gets all the way down to the 26. Right here, I end up stopping him. I see that he's trying to go for the short passes, and I was going to let him do that. But right here, somehow he breaks my foot, even though I was using it. It makes no sense, but that's EA for you. And you guys see, he ends up doing the onside kick. We end up recovering it, and that is pretty much game. We just end up running the ball out. And I was definitely pretty mad after this game because... Uh, this game, there's just so many flaws in it that it got exposed, and I was just so mad. Right here, though, he goes off sides, and we end up running the clock out. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new, and write a comment down below on what you would like to see next. It's your boy, Pick Droppers, and I'm out. Peace!